Hi everyone. We're going to find the first 100 multiples of 5. Basically what we're looking at is um, 5 plus 10 plus 15 plus we want to go all the way to the 100th term and um, that would be our last term or my 100th term. And basically uh, the sum formula is um, n over 2 times your first term plus your last term. This is your first term. Okay. And if I fill this out, I know I have my total n is 100 over 2. And my first term is 5, but I don't know what my last term is. And you can kind of guess but there's a way to get this accurate and we're going to find our nth term and use our formula for arithmetic sequences and my first term would be 5 my n is 100 minus 1 and your common difference is 5 so that's going to be um, 5 plus 99 times 5 which equals 5 plus 495, so my last term is 500, which a lot of you probably already guessed because 100 times 5, but so 500. So um, this is going to be um, 50 times 5 um, plus 500. You can distribute or you can just use your calculator. And we'll get 25,250. Now I did another one so that you can try and uh, let's find the first 50 multiples of 5. So um, where do you think we're going to end? We're probably going to end at... Um, what do you think? So let's, let's, this again would be, uh, we're going to use our sum formula. So that's going to be the first 50. And my first term is going to be 5. But I don't know what my last term is. So to find the last term, we're going to use our nth term formula. My first term is 5 plus 50 minus 1 common difference is 5. So that's going to be 5 plus 49 times 5. And 49 times 5 is going to be 245. So we're ending at uh, 250. Again, you could have just multiplied those two and got that. So uh, we're going to plug this back in, 250, into um, this here. And so we're going to get our sum is 25 times 255. And that gives you 6,375. Okay, the next video I'm going to do is the first 100 positive multiples of 4. You might want to try that first. And thank you and have a nice day. Bye-bye.